a shocking shake-up as 11 ministers may lose their jobs. Even Baji Bamila could be replaced also with Fashola, says a very reliable source. The presidency has confirmed that a cabinet reshuffle is on the horizon, indicating that up to 11 ministers could soon be released of their positions. This development was shared during a media briefing at the presidential villa in Abuja by the special advisor to the president on information and strategy, Bayo Onanuga. Joining Onanuga at the briefing, Otega Ogra, senior special assistant to the president on digital and new media, did not provide a specific timeline for the reshuffle of the president's cabinet, but hinted that an announcement could be made any time to this effect. Insiders who spoke with Guardian noted that the long-anticipated changes were postponed following the conclusion of the Federal Executive Council meeting. It is true that President Bola Tinibu has planned to reshuffle his cabinet, but no one can say specifically whether that will be done before the independence celebration on October 1st, Onanuga stated, emphasizing that the president especially appointed his ministers in August of last year. Reports suggest that chief of staff to the president, Femi Bajabiamila, is among those potentially facing dismissal. Why the exact details remains unclear. It has been made known that a comprehensive review of ministerial performance is underway as pressure mounts from various stakeholders for a more effective cabinet. The platform disclosed that former minister of Works and Housing, Babatunde Fashola, is noted to have been identified as a likely replacement for Bajaba Mila if he declines the offer. The current principal secretary to the president, Akin Muri, Okunola has been identified to fill the void. The Minister of Finance and Coordinating Minister of the Economy, Wale Edu, is expected to get a junior minister in the person of Sherman, Presidential Fiscal Policy and Tax Reform Committee. Mr. Taiwo Oyedele, while decisive action is likely to be taken on the ministers of humanitarian affairs and poverty alleviation, better edu. Insiders note that the ministry might be scrapped due to the level of malfeasance and, and corruption perpetrated under the guise of intervention programs. 
also the Minister of Communication, Innovation and Digital Economy, Bosun Tajini, Minister of State, Environment and Economic Management, Ishak Saloko, Minister of Budget and Economic Planning, Atiku Bagudu, and a few others may not be lucky in the imminent cabinet reshuffle of President Bola Hamed Tinibu. According to those familiar with the imminent changes, so ministers may be moved to other ministries, while those found to have performed below expectation, Pearl will be removed. The insider also noted that a minister who serves under the Buhari administration will likely be returned to serve under the president and present administration led by Bola Ahmed Tinibu. The official confirmation of a cabinet shake-up comes after months of speculation since President Bola Tinibu's first anniversary office as Nigerians grumbled about the need for better governance performance amid economic challenges. This is also happening against this backdrop of some ministers falling below expectation regarding his renewed hope agenda of President Bola Ahmed Tinibu record after a year President Bola Tinibu's inaugurated his 45 minister cabinet. Many Nigerians expressed displeasure with the team's performance. So guys, as you give your comment on the comment section below, many other Nigerians have also commented, such as Precious Oko, who says, May I tell you, Ibus don't care about all of these nonsensical narratives of President Bola Tinibu demonic operations in Nigeria. A criminal-minded fellow like Tinibu will never make any good choice at all. Ibus and South South don't want to be involved in this Tinibu's administration apart from Yisom Wiki. So guys, kindly give your comment on the comment section below. And do not forget to like and subscribe to Bliss channel. Thank you.